Attention all boomerites. Listen, I did it. There's a Muppet on the loose. Please use extreme caution when watching this video. Hello there, boomerites. Hey guys. What's going on? We are getting back into the IT crowd. Took a little short break from it, I guess. This is, um, honestly, I like this show so much more than I thought it was going to. Really? Yeah, it's really funny. It's random, which is right up my alley. Here's the question, though. What? Do you like it more than Father Ted? I don't know. You don't know? Is it it's weird only been that, one like, season, Father though. Ted is, like... Like, this is funny, but, like, Father Ted was, like, such a feel-good show in a weird way. Does that make sense? Yeah. Like, it made me feel warm inside. Yeah. And I'm repping your face. Yeah. Maybe this I should sell merch soon. Boomer. Maybe I should sell merch. I think merch. I made it for, like, your birthday. Yeah. Along with the Queen Boomer shirt. With the Queen Boomer shirt. Yeah. Which you wear a lot more than this one. Yeah, well, I just, I feel like it's... Weird to wear your own Kind face. of like, you know, the, yeah, it's, it's not very, uh, there's not much humility to wearing something that has your own face on it. You well, know? I like to wear it because it's my fiance's face. Well, there you go. Thank you. Yeah. All right. So, IT crowd. This one is the workouting episode one from season two. Oh, I saw in the comments so. that this one's really funny. Really? Yeah. Sometimes when I feed the baby and I'm bored, I just go through the comments. And someone said this was a really good episode. This is one of the reasons why I tend to avoid the comments. Oh, yeah. At times, because uh, I don't want to be surprised. Oh, somebody's wiggling. Well, we better get started before she, she just did wakes a little back snuggy up. Wiggle. She did a little snuggy wiggle. When you're like, mm, I like yeah. this. That's what she did. But uh, season two. So, we, so we're doing the, the ones I do with you are this and plebs yeah. at the moment. And then... Um, I just saw it. Uh, Fat Sam, shout out to you. Uh, he was wondering if we're going to do Idiot Abroad. There's, apparently there's only wow. three episodes of season three. I still want to do it, though. So, okay, well, okay. We'll, get, we'll get around to that sometime soon. But remember, folks, like, subscribe, do whatever you guys want. And don't take us seriously, because we're just a couple of Muppets. Yeah. Okay? Oh, one thing. Uh, I When I first dropped one of these... Somebody was uh, making a lot of... Actually, which one was it? It was uh, the one on YouTube that I dropped. Mm -hmm. And you were trying out different jingles. Yeah. And they said they're all shit, by the way. <laughs> oh. I tried. Their words, I not mine. Your, your jingle, sir. But, um... If someone calls something shit, you have to present but something better. They <laughs> One of them... Well, here you go. One of them oh, did Teddy. say, I just want to hear the Father Ted jingle again. Oh, okay. Well, so you want to do that one? Sure. Father Tid, Father Tid, what you gonna do today, Father Tid? There we go. There we go. All right. Like, subscribe, do whatever you guys want. Let's do it. Here we go. I thought the intro was kind of weird at first, but now I love it. Whenever that they're falling down that thing, I want to do that little... <laughs> <laughs> Me too. I like don't know Me why too. I want to yeah. do it. I'm like, I probably won't be able to hit the note, but I think I did kind of good. <laughs> that was not bad. I just won 450 quid playing poker. Well done. So that one coming, Mikey73. That's my rent sorted this month. Oh, and I can buy that new... Oh no, I've lost it all again. <laughs> <clears throat> Jen. Oh, Philip, hello. Hi. This is Philip from Six. This is Moss, this is Roy. Hi. Hi. Hi, uh... So, what brings you to my lair? Not that I'm some sort of animal. <laughs> or, or maybe I am. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh, um, I was just, uh, wondering if, uh, you, um, had the latest heat. Uh, yes, yes, there it is. Thanks. And, <clears throat> sorry about this, I don't suppose maybe you'd like to come to theatre tomorrow night, maybe, or...? I'd be delighted. <laughs> He means me, Moss. He was looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> I you love, love this guy. I like how he said it. He was so straightforward. She's like, 
He was looking at me, or he was asking me, Moss. He was looking at me, like he says it so. You love Moss, I yeah. He wasn't. I think he was. <laughs> You're not even in his eye line. Philip, who are you talking to, me or Jen? Do you like the theatre? Never been. But uh, uh, I've always liked the idea of the theatre. The smell of the grease, the roar of the paint. <laughs> I've often thought if I hadn't ended up in computers, I would have gone into the theatre. But you've never been to see a play? No. Why not? Never had the interest. Are there any famous people in it? No. It's a pass from me then, thank you. They haven't been invited anywhere. Oh, wait, uh, Laura Knightley's in it. Laura Knightley from the bill? She's gorgeous. You know what? I will come, Philip, thank you. <laughs> There's no invitation. Show me the invitation. Well, uh, I guess, you know, you guys could come too if you wanted. Oh. I know people in the show, so tickets aren't a problem. Great, right, that's settled then. Right, uh, well, I'll give you a call later then, give you the details. Um, how's that? That is perfection itself, Philip. Thank you very much. Thanks for coming down, man. Catch you later. That could have been a date there. Now it's a work outing. <laughs> Sorry, I nearly forgot the heat. Oh, yes. It's, uh, that's. Huh. What? He actually did want to borrow the copy of his. <laughs> so? Well, it's just, you know. Huh. No, I don't. What? I'm just surprised. Why? It's just I don't know many heterosexual men who read his. Huh. What? He's oh, gay. Like... Just because he reads Heat magazine. Girl magazine or something. Yeah, I don't know. I've never heard of it. Yeah, I haven't heard of it either. I've never really. I never subscribed I thought... to any. Have you ever been like subscribed to any? Ma I mean, probably today. If anybody subscribed to a magazine, it's online. But... I have a story about a magazine. Okay. <laughs> so I was getting my nails done, and I was like, I don't know, twelve, and I was with my mom, and we were getting like our toes done and stuff. And there was a Cosmopolitan magazine. Do you know what a Cosmopolitan magazine is? I've heard of it. It's like for girls. It's about girl stuff. And it's about relationships. It's about sex stuff. Mm -hmm. And there was like one page that was like ways to make your man happy. And I was like 12. So I didn't have a boyfriend. But I like knew one day like I wanted a boyfriend. Because that's mm -hmm. like the age you start like liking, liking boys. And the first thing said to give them a ball massage. And in my little innocent 12-year-old head, I was like, would you, like, rub, like, a tennis ball on their back or something? So I was like, oh, so, like, men really like, like, ball massages. Like, I literally thought that that was, like, it was a nice thing to do for your partner. And I was like, that's so sweet. And, like, literally, I don't know where I was, but, like, two years later, I remember reading that from a Cosmopolitan magazine. And I went, oh, they didn't mean tennis balls. That's, that's what I imagine the Heat magazine is. What did this magazine... It said how many ways to please your man? It said, yeah, like different ways to please your man. And yeah. one of them... Like yeah, the, how many did it say? How many? I think it was like... I don't remember. It was, it, like, it was at least like... It filled up the whole page. So probably ten. Ten? Yeah. It wasn't like a hundred? No. Okay. Well, even ten's long. <laughs> oh, what do you need to please Every guy man? out there knows that the, that thing is three things long. What and is I, it? I, I'm not telling you. I'm gonna let them tell what you in the it? comments. No, you need to tell me, fellas. That list is ha that list is three things long, isn't it? Do I hit and all? And you three? guys write down the three things. Do I hit all three? No. No. Oh, do you hit all three? Yes. I saw, thought you said, "Did you hit all three? I was like, "You only told me about one, and that was something you don't even do." <laughs> <laughs> do you want a ball massage? What? That doesn't even feel good. No, like, ball like even massage. if it's the one they're talking about, that doesn't even feel good. I mean, you don't do it down there. You do it like. What if you did do it down there? Like you know how sensitive those things are. If one of them gets clocked a certain way, you're, well, you're, apparently you're the Cosmo out of commission girls, for five apparently minutes. Apparently the Cosmo girls like it. I want to know what these three things are. I'm you heard that, fell. You I'm heard that, fell. She wants to know the three best ways to please your man. What so you guys food? write them write them down in the comments below. I that's all I'm gonna say. Okay, I'm gonna guess that it's 
food. Okay. Bow chicka wow wow. <laughs> okay. And. Drama free. Okay. Easy to get along with. Okay. Am I right? I can't tell you. They're going to oh tell Oh my you. god. Alright. Alright, continue. Um, well, he's either gay or a woman in her early 20s. <laughs> no, 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 no. Why else would he ask me out on a date? Uh, are you sure he meant it as a date date? Are you sure you're not going along as his gal pal? <laughs> if you're talking about who I think you're talking about, then the answer is yes, he is gay. <laughs> Oh, everyone knows. And what's more, he's been gay since Wham. <laughs> We're talking about Philip. He borrowed heat. He borrowed heat. Ooh la la. <laughs> and he knows people in the theatre. That's not a euphemism. He actually does know people in the theatre. Anyway, it's a date. I'm sure it is. Why else would he ask me out? Well... Don't take this the wrong way, but could he have thought you were a man? <laughs> right, let's get a taxi. It's a ten-minute walk. Oh, 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 no. An all-night walking. Why do you just not come? Then you won't have to walk anywhere. It's OK. I'm not going to spoil your romantic evening with the gay man. He's not a gay man. He reads heat. Hey, where are you lot off to? Oh, look. Richard's hey. still alive. <laughs> hey, wait, I didn't hear what he said. Right? Sorry. He's not a gay man. He reads heat. Hey, where are you lot off to? Oh, look, Richmond's still alive. <laughs> it's He looks way different when he doesn't have the uh, yeah, he does. makeup on. That's how he like kind of looks like in real life. Yeah, he looks semi-normal. <laughs> We're going to the theatre. Hey, do you want to come? Oh, no. No, thank you. And you shouldn't go either. Why not? An ill wind is blowing. <laughs> Last night, I was stirred from my slumber by a crow calling three times. Caw. <laughs> Oh. Well, you know what a crow sounds like. <laughs> Passing to my window, I trod on a piece of Lego. Oh, it went right in the heel. <laughs> Turning on my television set, I noticed the reception wasn't great. Not terrible, just not great. <laughs> Hear me well. No good can come of your trip to the theatre tonight. No good at all. And if you ask me... Yeah, but I was going to say the only one. That's just bloody rude. Where's my heat? <laughs> oh my god. A gay musical called Gay. <laughs> Roy oh just god. made it ten times funnier. <laughs> oh man. That's quite gay. Yep. Gay musical. Aren't all musicals gay? This must be like the gayest musical ever made. It's got some pretty good reviews. <laughs> <laughs> the story of a young man trying to find his sexuality in the uncaring Thatcher years. Warning. Includes scenes of graphic homoeroticism. Oh, no. It's set in the 80s. <laughs> graphic homoeroticism. Does that mean they're going to get them out? You're not comfortable with your sexuality? Oh, I'm very comfortable with my sexuality. I just don't want to be slapped in the face with their sexuality. <laughs> oh, look, there's Philip. Oh, look, he's lecturing at that lady. Thank God for that. He's just an ordinary, ignorant man. <laughs> oh, hey, you're already here. Yeah. <laughs> what are we doing, Roy? This isn't oh, us. Yeah. It takes place in the past. Forget the play. Philip knows the cast. It's all about the backstage party afterwards. Those things are great. You just have to go up to everybody, tell them that they were brilliant, and it's free white wine all night. And besides, I really want to meet Laura Knightley. Hey, the guys. Wow. Looks great, doesn't it? Right, we should really pick up a ticket. I know someone who gets the pickle. <laughs> Sorry, I loved it. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah what? He's gay. Oh, yeah? If two men tickle each other. <laughs> Is that the sign? Would you go tickle your guy friend? No. In front of a girl? No. No. 
Would you tickle me? Yeah. In front of... I don't know where I'm going with I'd this. I'd tickle you in front of the president. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> this is Jerome. He does publicity for the show. He got us our tickets. Oh, great. Thanks. This is Jen and Moss and Roy. Hello, hello. Hello, how's it going? Oh, my God, you're Irish. I love Irish people. They're just mad, aren't they? They're just mad. <laughs> We're all insane, yeah. Well, you're... <laughs> <laughs> We're all insane, yeah. <laughs> That's great. Okay, he says it's so That's probably like how we, some of us over here, like if one of, let's say one of the boomerites from uh, the UK or Australia or wherever they are, mm -hmm. um, visits here in the States. How many of your friends do you think are going to be like, oh my God, you're British. Yeah. Say something British. <laughs> no, that's my friend um, Anya. She came to visit Well, she's me. Irish. Yeah, she's Irish. But she came to visit me one time at Duffy's. And... If you're watching, hello. Hi, Anya. And she, um... To Jordan. Was like, is Kale working? And then he came in and was like, Kale! Kale! <laughs> and I was like, oh my... I was like, why do you say my name like that? And he's like, there's someone outside that wants to see Kale! <laughs> he loved it. Didn't you say that, uh... She... When she was here in the States... She loses she, her accent. She lost her accent and gets a little more bit. Of a valley girl. Kind yeah, of but then it's when still she... Irish, it's like an Irish valley girl accent. Yeah. It's weird. But then when she goes back home, I don't understand the look she's saying. <laughs> oh my gosh! And um, when she like comes when like I used to work with her, the day she would come back, she would say something to me like kind of from afar, <laughs> and she was like, "How did I get the something, something, something?" And I was like, "I have no idea what you said. I heard trash can, and that's about it." <laughs> I feel like that's my ears when it comes to uh, the Scottish accent. Yeah. I have a hard time. I actually just did a another Kevin Bridges reaction, and that'll drop on. It's probably dropped on YouTube two weeks before this air video airs on YouTube. Mm -hmm. But uh, he it, uh, he actually was translating some of his own slang oh, really? in the video for me, and I appreciated the hell out of that because like it's not all of it. It's like around ten percent of what. Scottish people say, I'm like, I'm like, what the fuck did they just say? Do you know what? But um, most, most of it, it's, it's like, all right, I got it. But then like, there's that 10% where I'm like, I have no idea what you just said. From like my Spanish friends and my Irish friends and mm. my friends from South Africa, they say that we talk painfully slow. Americans? Yes. We yeah. talk slowly. Yeah. We're, we talk slower than most other languages. Yeah. Lang uh, people yeah oh hello how's it going oh my god you're irish i love irish people they're just mad aren't they they're just mad <laughs> we're all insane yeah well you'll love this it's groit crack oh my god i'm mad for crack <laughs> well, quick everyone show's about to start <laughs> i feel like i've seen that guy in something before the gay okay. <laughs> the gay musical Oh, oh man! Lord, Miley isn't gonna be dressed up like Toy or something. Who's she in the bin again? Remember, she plays that heroin addict that gets stabbed in the face. Oh, she is lovely, isn't she? Not? <laughs> oh God, here we go. It might be all right. Yeah, not that good. What the hell? Welcome to the United. Queendom! <laughs> Brilliant. He left him Queendom. He can't say that, can he? Oh, he loves it. <laughs> He's the only one dancing. Today, today, the home of home skin. skin. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Imagine being on a live performance like this is always like, yeah, yeah. There was a comedian I was listening to who was saying, he was like, if I have a gay son, I don't care. He's like, if he wants to do a sport, I'll cheer. But if he wants to do ballet, I'm still going to cheer the same I would at a sport. And he was like, yeah, do that, pal, that plie, That's funny. David. That's funny. I'm a friend of Dorothy. I'm a friend of Dorothy. She is my friend. This is 
insanely brilliant. <laughs> Hold my hand. No, that's not my hand. <laughs> I'm completely satisfied. Don't leave, it's rude. Nah, it's too gay for me. Thought I could handle it, but I can't. It'll be the interval soon. Well, I'm captivated, Roy. Calm down, at least it can't get any worse. All right, get them house lights up. Let's have a look at you. <laughs> You're wearing that shirt for a bet. All its participation. Go, 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 go. Oh, uh -oh. what have we here? Hello. <laughs> 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 yes! Yeah. <laughs> you love the most socially awkward people. I do. Even if they're fake, like if I it's do. a character that somebody's playing. If they're socially awkward, you love it. I do. <laughs> so, tell me, who wears the trousers in this relationship? What? Oh, right, no, we're not homosexuals. We're just very good friends. So you never had a look? At what? His bum! <laughs> I've seen it um, when he <laughs> crossed it in front of my desk. Or should he bend over to pick something up? I'd love to work in that office. Oh, there's nothing sexual going on. I do like Roy, but I'm not curious. <laughs> Engaging him for? He was asking me questions. I couldn't just ignore him. It'd be rude, Roy. So what do you think of it? I think it's fabulous. Every value I've ever held has been questioned, and I'm loving it. <laughs> you don't like it, do you? The songs are good? No, they're not. Hum one of the songs. Willies, willies, I like willies. It's, I love willies. Oh. I love willies. So could you keep it down? Yeah. I'm not going back in there. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, no, no, no. I'll wait out here for you, but there is no way I'm going anywhere near that thing. Oh, you can't leave me alone in there. I don't know what the hell's going on. He's laughing like an idiot at every single gay reference. Why did you come after it? Like? He doesn't want to miss anything. I need to wee wee. Yeah, me too. Oh, what's wrong? I've got a toilet coming. Oh, hey, toilet. Well, let's just get her over with. I hate this too. Do you? It's well, I hate it because it's like they try to like wash your hands for you. Well, this is. <laughs> I get drunk and give them a hundred dollars. Jesus. Yeah, I've done that like twice. I did that when we went to the fair. Callie. What? <laughs> I get overly nice when I'm. I'm drink. like, well, yeah, like they are at the. They just stand there at the doorway and like. At least the ones that like try to like give you things to wash your hands, like mm -hmm. do something. But the ones that, like at the fair specifically, the ones that they don't do anything. They just stand there, and it's like they expect you to tip them on I the way out. I think she complimented me when I gave her. Yeah, up. they expect. I was like, thank you, to give her hundred. They expect you to tip them on the way out. It's like, what did you do? She said she liked my boots. What? Thank you for what? Staring at me? Well, they like cleaned the bathroom. No, did you? No, how could I? The bloke stood looking at us. What was that? It's not my fault he works in a toilet. How much did you give him? A pound. I just paid a pound 
not to go to the toilet. <laughs> a terrible toilet, Kai. He should work somewhere where people don't want to go to the toilet. I'm going to use the disabled. You can't use the disabled. What? Why not? You're not disabled. You'll get in trouble. <laughs> it's not like a parking space, Moss. I think. I think it's OK, isn't it? It's OK. I'm always using the disabled. It's illegal. <laughs> I think it actually might be illegal. No. But who knows? <laughs> Is that the one that calls somebody? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um. <sighs> Hello? Hello? You all right in there? You better fall. Um, do you need help? I'm disabled. That sounds like story too. From the door. What? No! Oh! Why is that the voice of a disabled person? What are you doing? Don't panic! <laughs> whoa, 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 what's, whoa, what's happening? Someone's had an accident. What? What? Well, you better keep going then. I just saw this guy in plebs. He was the uh, guy. Remember, he was the guy who was. like, organized the uh, fucking. Well, what is it? The uh, the protest because he was uh, Marcus was made in charge by the Egyptian yeah. guy's son. Was he? And he was the one who was like, "All right, things." Are, he's like, "See, I knew you were all talk." Was he? Yeah, it looks like the same guy. Oh, I don't maybe. Know. He was like, "I knew you were all talk. It's all just the same." Yeah. But anyway, he's not a toga, so I don't recognize. Yeah. <laughs> What's happening? Someone's had an accident. What? what? Well, you better keep going then. Oh my god, what happened? I fell off the toilet. <laughs> well, good, well, come on, let's let's get let's get you upright. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, what happened? <coughs> oh, excuse me. God. Wow, that came out of nowhere. I'm disabled. How? How what? How are you disabled? Uh, leg disabled. Oh, wait, 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 I'm being... Do you have a wheelchair? Yes. Where? Stolen. How did they get in? I don't know. Oh, 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 oh. Let's get you out of here, too. Unreal. Sorted out. Oh, he's Paul with the wheelchair. All right. This is why you shouldn't lie, folks. You no. got. If you do, you got to keep playing it out. What? I keep one in the office oh. for emergencies. Let's get you up, nice and gently. That's oh. it. That's it. There we go. Okay. Oh. Oh. There we are. There. Oh. Oh. He's like an owl. Oh, the police! Everything all right? Everything all right? See ya. I'm disabled. <laughs> So, someone stole your... My wheelchair. I, I'm disabled. Some lazy bastard just waltzed in there. Can you describe it? It's all over so quickly. Well, just tell us what you can. Caucasian male. Um, bearded. Red hair. Glasses. Possibly a disguise. I... All right, thank you. Do you need any help getting home? No, I'm, I'm fine. I'm with people. Here they are now. <laughs> Hello, fellas. Oh, no, I'll take a 
You're nonsense, it's Lisa. Okay. <laughs> you slacking off in there? Go and get changed. Oh, no. Excuse me, sir. Can I have a word? Oh, no! So powerful. Oh, God. Oh, the, the grit of it. Five stars. <laughs> so what did you think? Of the musical. Or did you not just love it? Well, no. Sorry. Why not? I don't know. It's just... Maybe you have to be... gay. <laughs> but I loved it. Yeah, I guess it's more of a gay thing. You know, you have to be gay. A gay man. A homosexual. Well, all I know is I loved every last second of it. And I'm not usually a fan of musicals. Hey, do you want to meet the cast? Oh. Come on. Uh, the thing is, I have to meet Moss and Roy. That sound of him getting slowly pulled out, that killed me. And he's just like... Oh, no. Oh. So good. This show is fucking great. <laughs> he's like, well, gotta live with this lie. <laughs> Look at them, they all think they did a good deed by helping this way. I know. Hey, listen, I told the cast about what happened, and they told me to get you all to come back and meet them. Yay! <laughs> come on, everybody, off the van. <laughs> <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> it's so stupid. Oh, I fucking love it. Oh, I love it. That, did that sound funny though? He's just like. It sounded really funny the second time we had to go back. I mean, listen to that. It's oh like, welcome, you're coming all back. Come back and meet them. Yay! Come on, everybody. Get the van. jaw hurts <laughs> wow it's been some time since my jaw has fucking hurt from a reaction man oh, i think the second part that made it so funny was that when they said that his face was just like yeah it sounds about right yeah ow ow my stomach ow this is gonna stop oh my god oh god oh my god oh <sighs> Five minutes left or whatever. Hey, James! Oh, wow, Edgar. Hi! Oh, brilliant. Jeremy! How do you know all these young, good-looking men? Oh, you know, just from around. Hey, Jerome! Come here, you great show. No, darling. Listen, I can't talk at the moment. I've got a disabled group coming in for a chat. Here they are now. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Wait, wait, what did he say? He said I can't talk. talk at the moment. I've got a disabled group coming in for a chat. Here they are now. Oh, a disabled group, okay. I thought he said a Satan group. I was like, Gotta what? Go. had quite an evening. Someone stole his wheelchair. Oh really? Did you see who it was? Red bearded man. Uh-huh. 
How long have you been disabled? <laughs> Ten years. Ten years. <laughs> and how did it happen, if that's not a rude question? Acid. <laughs> What are the chances of that happening? Uh, hundred to one. <laughs> you look like you could do with a drink. Whiskey, please double. Excuse me. Yes, miss. You know what? The mom is the one who would take would just go full into being the employee. He would. He, he would. would. He's just like, I work here now. He would. <laughs> oh my Lord. god. Oh my god. Oh. Uh, the funny thing it was, like, we knew this was going to happen. Yeah. I just didn't expect and it to come up still, right at that moment. still, when it happened, yeah. we lost it. Well, because they took so long to, like, introduce him as a staff member that I kind of forgot they did. about Yeah, they yeah. focused on Roy's disability yeah. for a while, yeah. Oh, my God. Technical disability. Oh, boy. <laughs> She's like, what the fuck is going on? Can I have a double whiskey, please? Double whiskey. And a glass of white wine. A glass of white wine. Thank you. You're very welcome, madam. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> At first, oh my god. Was doing great. <laughs> Sorry doing for. I think I just wrecked everyone's ears. I think you did. Because I totally smacked the microphone. By accident. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> he fucking dropped everything. Okay. <sighs> Can I have a double whiskey, please? Double whiskey. And a glass of white wine. A glass of white wine. Thank you. You're very welcome, madam. Here's the thing, though. Everything back there needs to be cleaned now. Yeah. Because you can't serve somebody... If you even think broken glass got anywhere. Yeah. Little uh, insider thing for bartenders. If your if you drink is know, taking it, it, 30 minutes, this might be a reason why. Right. Cause, uh, and this happens usually like once a shift. Mm -hmm. A glass gets broken. But if it breaks near the ice bin, then they have to... Take out all the ice, no matter how full it is. Take out all the ice, and then clean out the ice bin and make sure there's not one piece of glass. And anywhere. if it's broken by other glass, you have to wash all that yep. glass so that like a piece of broken glass isn't on a glass. So yeah, it happens. Slows everything down. Happens all the time. Uh, hello, Lord Knightley. How are you? I'm disabled. It must be so difficult being gay and disabled. Very difficult. Oh, come here, my little soldier. What's the matter? I don't know. You're from Telly. I am. And you know, the little birdie told me that you couldn't make the show tonight. So I've got you two tickets for tomorrow. doing so well. Yeah. High five. High five. <laughs> oh, no. Laura, couple of photos. Oh. <laughs> Is he from the newspaper? Yes, he's from the standard. Oh, so, do you know, that's the whole reason he went was to see her. Because she was the one oh, girl on the thing that he was like, well, she's in it, so I'll, I'll go just yeah. to see her. Good. I, I get it. Very funny, you Irish. Oh, I'm a bit tired. Can I have a wheelchair too? <laughs> Hilarious. Oh, my legs don't work. Help, help, I need a wheelchair. Come on, get up. Come on, stop buzzing around. I want to go. Oh my god. Oh, he's fine. <laughs> You're done. 
Good night. Would you ever go see a musical with yeah. me? I would. I feel like in London, I, I don't see a musical. I, They're so over the top and like theatrical wise. Well, it's here's really the pretty. thing. It's funny you mentioned that because you said in London specifically. Yeah, well, that's the only place. Here in the that. United States, I would fight you a little bit to see a musical. Yeah. In London, I would go 100% of the time just because I would want to see what the theater looked like over there. Yeah. Because um, I, I've heard. Uh, and I assume that the theaters over there are so much more grand and it's like um, even like their elaborate their artwork and everything right, they yeah. put into it is. I saw The Lion King in London and in New York. Yeah, here I I feel like most theaters here like that have live performances yeah. are just movie theaters that they took the screen out. Kind of. <laughs> you know? And I saw Chitty Chitty Bang Bang and the car flies over your head. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. interesting. But yeah, if it was in London, I'd I'd be like, I'm game. That had the child napper that has the lollipop and goes, hee 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 hee. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, for God's sake, are you gay? Are you a gay man? No! Are you? No, no brilliant, good. That's, because that's all I wanted to know. I don't mind. One way or another, you know, it's just I, I like being clear. I don't want any ambiguity. What on earth made you think I was gay? <laughs> well, oh, you know, I didn't just pull it out of the air. You know, you just brought me to a gay musical called Gay. I've been laughing like mad at every gay reference. Your friends, all of whom are gay, say hello by tickling you. <laughs> What century are you living in? Do you think that a man has to be gay to like a gay musical? Can a straight man not have homosexual friends? And since when was tickling gay? I missed that meeting, Jen. Jen, come here. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I guess you just threw me when you borrowed that copy of Heed. Oh, God, it's true. It's true. I'm gay. I'm a gay man. I tried to run from it to the knife. I can't. I can't. I can't. Oh, no. Jen, what am I going to do? I thought I could make it work between us because you looked a bit like a man. <laughs> wow. Oh, I'd be pissed. Wow. I'd be like, all right, I ain't helping you anymore. Damn. <laughs> 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 Hello there. I didn't see you on the way out. Right, lads, let's get a sing song going. So long- oh long- shit! Long- it's uh, Jay's father from Inter- oh, in- yeah, it is. in Betweeners. Yeah. To Manchester. Wait, hold on. I, I got so exci- I got so excited that it was him that I totally wasn't paying attention to what we were saying. Hold on, yeah. sorry guys. Right, lads, let's get a sing song going. It's a long way back to Manchester. <laughs> I'd get down to the end of the block and then be like, all right, try it. Night, Steve. Night, boss. Night, Melly, you be good. Not if I can help it. See? <laughs> he took on this role. Is that it? That was a good episode. It was. It was. Um, however, I feel like... Well, she's waking up, yeah. But I feel like uh, you said that people were very highly anticipating this one. Yeah. Which part do you think they were anticipating? Because I can't decide. It's part. just... The whole what? Wheelchair part. The whole wheelchair part? And okay. the musical. 
and the musical, Gay, Gay, Gay. Yeah. I mean, that whole episode was fucking great. It was. So I'd like, it's hard, because there were so many great parts in it. It's like, because you know, like when, um, usually when uh, our subscribers are like very excited about something for the future uh, uh, that they know we're going to react to. It's usually one specific part. Yeah. But this... No, that was like, a really good episode. I was... Af- as soon as it was over, I was like, well, what part did they really want us to see? Yeah. Because I liked all of it. Like, that that was... It was definitely the best episode of IT Crowd we've seen. It definitely was. That was super funny. Yeah. But I was like... that's That just shows you how good the episode is, because I couldn't pinpoint. I was like, there's got to be one specific thing that yeah, they want the us to see. Yeah, the whole wheelchair skit, though, I think. The wheelchair really part, um, the part where they uh, basically switched... Their identities, uh, Moss is behind the bar. Yeah, I and, like... And she thinks she's in the fucking Twilight Zone. And then, the, of course... The, the guy know, the... turning on the light and talking to Moss and the other guy I thought was really Yeah, funny. and then you got... Um... Is my boss waking up? Yeah, she is. Yep. Yep, she is. Alright. Yeah. Bye. Bye. She let me make it through the whole episode, though. Yeah, she did. But... She did. She needs her cow. She's hungry. Yes. Well, yeah, that was certainly a fantastic episode. But like I said, I was, I was, you know, when she told me that, I was like, there's got to be one specific thing that they, they're waiting for me to react to. But I couldn't pinpoint what it is. It, it's probably just because the episode is so great. Or is there something that you guys were specifically waiting for us to react to? I'm not quite sure. Because all of that episode was great. Uh, I guess in today's terms, controversial. Yes, maybe. Um, would something like this be put out in today's climate? You you definitely be be risking uh, risking the wrath of uh, of certain people. That's for sure. Uh, and I'm not talking about gay people. I'm talking about just people that don't like uh, jokes. <laughs> you know. Um, but yeah, that was a fantastic episode. I loved it. And it was I, I, by far the best episode so far. But all these episodes have been great. This uh, this now that we're on season two, I I dare say this might be our favorite show that we're reacting to at the moment. You never know. But I can't wait to watch more. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy the reactions. Like, subscribe, do whatever you want. And I'll see you again soon. Boom rights. Peace. Who is this ghastly man? Your one and only favorite Muppet. <laughs>